Hello and welcome to the Suffer City Virtual Training Program, the Digital Runner Series. Hey, my name is Jason. I'll be your guide for improved speed, endurance, along with increased metabolism and physiology, all to boost your performance and enhance your physique using running as the best tool ever. That's right, and today we've got for you a 25-minute heart pump and thumper, the Encino Run. That's right, 25 minutes of speed intervals beginning at a one minute hard run and ending with these 10 second short burst sprints. That's right, you're gonna charge through three rounds of each timed effort, beginning with that one minute effort. You're gonna get that hard, aggressive, high energy, results producing running that you're looking for. That's right, whether you're in the market for lean, hard muscle, faster run times, you've come to the right place. The Suffer City Digital Runner has you covered from start to finish. And we're going to get started right here with that three-minute warm-up, kicking off that first speed, maybe that trot, that jog, that run in three. Here we go in two, and here we go in one. That's right, we're kicking off our three-minute warm-up here. Getting started on the Encino run. That's right, 25 good minutes of moving that body, lifting the knee, good foot strikes. And hey, let's talk about our running mechanics. There's three important running variables. Beginning with that foot strike, ensuring you're feeling the sole of that foot. High five, the surface of the ground upon which you're running. Whether you're on a treadmill today, out there on the trail, or you're pounding the pavement of your neighborhood, just be mindful of how the sole of your foot is striking upon the surface of that ground. That's right. As we move into rounding the first corner here, that first minute of our warm up, just about done moving into the second minute, you're also going to begin to pay attention to your posture. Moving from the foot strike to the posture, noticing the chin lift, the heart lift a little. You're going to feel the rib cage muscles begin to inflate a little bit. Noticing with each foot strike the awareness of your core and the muscle of your ab, absorbing that energy. We're just about a minute and 20 seconds into your three minute warm up. Now, this may be the moment where you're beginning to notice the third variable of those running mechanics, and that's the mechanics of breathing. Beginning to notice the exhale, the full exhalation of that breath. That inhale, that exhale, that is the air gas exchange, the way in which your body's gonna pull oxygen out of the air, send oxygen to the muscles of the body to keep your body moving and grooving to this 25 minute good effective interval run. We're just about two minutes into it right here, getting into the third minute of the warm up, checking in with your foot strike, Noticing the posture, paying attention to the breathing, setting the attention for your run right here, right now. We got just about a minute left to warm it up. Now remember, we got our five running speeds. We got that trot, that baseline, survival trot speed. And you got that second gear, your jog. We'll be utilizing right here in that warm up and then you've also got that third gear a good hard run now that run is something you may find yourself running at a mile or maybe a 5k pace and you've also got a good hard run that's our fourth gear speed you may be finding that here today early and then today you'll be exercising as well that fifth that final gear that sprint based effort that's right those are our five solid gears of running today we're going to begin with our first effort it's one minute Taking it up at least to that run, maybe a hard run as you lock in right here. Kicking off one minute in three. Here we go in two, and here we go in one. 60 seconds of good movement. Again, checking in with those running mechanics. The soles of the feet striking the surface of the runner. You're as tall, as confident as you've been all day. So again, noticing the breath as you're 20 seconds into your first one minute effort. Now we're halfway through, 30 seconds to go. Again, checking in with that confident posture. Notice the chin is up, the chest is up. With 20 seconds to go, you may find yourself lifting upward and forward. Sending a good charge towards that finish line. It's about 10 seconds to go here. Come on, you got this. And we're gonna take it to a walking recovery in three, in two. And one, let's walk it out. We got a full minute here. Now you're gonna notice the pattern here really is you've got two more of these one minute efforts. 
followed by a one minute dose of recovery. From there on out, we're gonna continue to reduce 10 seconds off the effort, taking three rounds at that time effort. So we'll go from a minute to 50 seconds and then three rounds at that time, and then 40 seconds, and so on and so forth, all the way down to your 10 second effort. Again, early, already noticing that breath, and checking in with that posture. Being mindful of the gears that running speed you're moving through from the beginning of the run towards the end of each one of these efforts. As we set into this second effort here, this one minute effort, let's begin to bring into the mind the intention of your purpose for being here today. What got you out of bed, what got you on this trail, on this treadmill, wherever you're at, what got you here today? Let's check in with that motivation. Commit this one minute effort to it right here in three. Here we go in two, and here we go in one. We got one minute of a commitment so the reason that got you here today, whether it's your health, okay, is it your fitness? Is this a commitment you made to yourself or somebody else, whatever it may be, bring that idea, that motivation to your mind right here as you continue to lift the knees, pumping those elbows. You got 30 seconds to go on this one minute effort. Come on, keep moving. Still leaning forward, lifting the knees upward. And you've got that exhale available to you at any time. Yeah, you've got less than 10 seconds right here. Right now, staying with me. Now you're feeling it. Come on. Five seconds. And we got that walk and recovery in three and two and one again. Finding that walk, that breath where you check in with that confident version of yourself, reminding yourself why you're out here, why you're running that body, why you're breathing this breath, why you're feeling this pressure, putting yourself under this pressure. That motivation clearing the mind today as we move to each one of these efforts. Thirty seconds remains in your recovery here. Fueling your mind with one potent motivational thought after the next. Knowing the fuel of the mind will go into the body when you need it most. And we're going to lock into our third or final one minute effort right here. Shifting into those gears again. Locking in in three. Here we go in two. And here we go in one. Right here. That's right, one minute of work, another investment, a commitment to the purpose, to the reason that your motivation that got you here today. And we're 30 seconds in, less than 30 seconds to go. Yeah, now you're feeling it. Fueling the mind, fueling the body, one motivational idea of yourself at a time. Right here, we got 15 seconds to go. We're going to charge forward. Breathing for 10 seconds right here. The knees lift higher. All the way through. Oh, I know you got it right here. We got three. We got two. And we got one. Again, there's your walk and recovery. A full minute. Preparation for that 50-second effort upcoming. That's right, we're taking 10 seconds off the effort. And we'll get another 50 seconds of recovery after each one of these run efforts coming up. That's right. Hey, great job in this first three efforts. That's what we're talking about. Thirty seconds of walking tall. Breathing. Telling yourself, you're doing the hard work. This is you doing the hard work. The work you know that's got to get done, and this is you doing it. Be proud of yourself. Congratulate yourself right here. We got 15 seconds. All right, the work, hey, it's just getting started, right? We got a 50 second effort coming up. Still digging in, still working distance, one effort at a time. Let's lock in right here in three. 50 seconds of hard work in two, and here we go on one team. Let's lock in. Come on. 50 seconds. Maybe you're at that run speed. Maybe you're at that hard run speed. 
And maybe you're at that full sprint already, whatever it takes, right? Come on, let's do this. So you're halfway there already, 25 seconds to go. That's it, come on, keep charging. That's right, you're in command. You're in control of that body right now, every step of the way. Come on, the knees are lifted. You feel the chest engaged, shoulders engaged as you pump those elbows for 10 more seconds. Come on. Five to finish. And three, walk and recovery in two, and one, and there we go. Walk it out, breathe it out, 50 seconds. Great work. Still breathing. That chin is still high. That head is still high. That confident level is still high. All right, we're halfway through the recovery. You got 25 seconds to go. You're still breathing. That's right. This is you doing it right here. This is how you achieve your goal right here, by optimizing, energizing that process one effort at a time. 10 seconds, hey, refuel that mind with that motivation that got you here today, huh? What is it, why is it? You're feeling this breath and feeling this heat right here. Let's get another 50 seconds on board right here in three. Let's lock in in two, and here we go in one. Come on, 50 seconds. Thirty seconds to go. Yeah, you're running fast. That's right. This is you doing it. You got the speed. You've got the willingness. You can do this work. Come on. Twenty seconds. That's right. From fingertip to toe tip, you're in command of that body. We got ten seconds of work right here. Come on. Running that body. Five to finish. Keep the knees high for three, two. And there we go again, walking it out, breathing it out. Keeping your mind centered. Again, whatever that goal is you're here to achieve, whatever that motivation is, that has you compelled into action in this moment, that's what we're focused on. That's what it's about. Twenty-five seconds will be shifting gears back up into that good run, hard run, fifty-second effort. So your third, your final, fifty-second effort coming up right here. Committed to something that means something to you right here. As we lock in in three, here we go in two. And here we go in one, 50 seconds, come on. That's it. Still pushing forward. We got 30 seconds right here, what do you got? Come on, make this time mean something. Less than 20 to go, right here, right now, come on. That's it. Woo. Right there, you're doing it. This is you doing it, right here, come on, we are at less than 10. Stick with me right here. Come on, you got it. Keep pushing, knees lifting. We got three, we got two, and we got one. Bring it down again, walking, recover. You get that full 50 seconds of walking and recovering right here. All the motivation of the mind. We're going to turn the page again. We're going to take 10 seconds off your next step. 40 seconds of work coming at you. Right now you're breathing. Another 30 seconds of recovery. Another 30 seconds of reminding yourself why you're out here. What that goal is you're here to achieve. Okay? This is you achieving it. This is it happening right here. We got 10 seconds coming up. 40 seconds of work. That's right. Less and less time. Higher and higher energy outputs with each succeeding effort right here as we lock in. 
40 seconds in three. Here we go in two, and here we go in one, team. Let's get them. Come on. That's right. Now you're in the flow. Now you're in the rhythm. Now you're ready to go. Keep moving that body. This is your body. You're in charge of that body right here. Right now. Less than 30 seconds. Come on. That's it. Feel the shoulders work. The upper body's engaged. As you lean. Lift those knees upward. Come on. Oh, you got this. 15 seconds. 10 to finish. Push. Lean. Lift. Push. Lean. Lift. We got three. Two. Another walking recovery. 40 seconds. 40 seconds. That's right. Yeah. Even as you're walking, notice your abdominal force. Notice the muscle of your abdomen. Notice your breath ventilating. Rib cage expanding. Contracting. Hey, that's your muscle. That's right. That's your muscle getting chiseled. One effort, one breath at a time. Now, we've only got 15 seconds here to recover. So, hey, check in with that goal one more time. Hey, it's worth it. Not any discomfort you may be experiencing. You know it's worth it. Here we go. Five seconds. This is your second 40-second effort right here in three. Here we go in two. And here we go in one. Come on. That's right. That's right. Speed. Endurance. Maybe it's fat burning. Hey, maybe it's the physique you're working for. This is you working for. Work for it. The harder you work, the more likely it is to come. You got 20 seconds right here. Come on. Five to finish. Staying focused through that finish line for three and two. And one, once again, you're walking recovery. That's it. Good breathing. Quality thinking. And this is you doing whatever it takes. Whatever you want. Whatever it is you're working for. You're going to have to do whatever it takes in order to get it. This is you doing the work right here. We got 15 seconds. Refuel that mind right here. Remind yourself. This is why I'm doing this. This is why I'm here. Five seconds. So our final 40 second effort right here, that's right. Final one. We're gonna get him. Let's lock in in three. Here we go in two. And here we go in one, two. Yeah, now you're fierce. Now you know you're competent, you know you can do this, and you're using that knowledge to fuel each and every effort, one after the next. You're coming up to the halfway point. We got less than 20 seconds right here, come on. Yes, your body has been constructed to do just this, to move that energy, to move with energy, to move as energy. Less than 10, come on. We got three seconds, two, and one. And there we go, 40 seconds now, walking tall, good exhalations. Notice the full expiration of that breath, one after the next. Yeah, 20 seconds and we, keep, we turn another page. Onto our 30 second efforts here. Now the recoveries will also be at 30 seconds. So this will begin happening faster, faster as we move into it. 30 seconds of work. Let's lock into that focus, lock into that motivation right here for three. Here we go in two, and here we go in one. 30 seconds, come on. That's right. Is you doing it right here? You got it, come on. Commanding yourself from one stride to the next stride. The knees driving hard. The upper body strong as the elbows pump. We got less than 10 seconds right here. Coming up on five to finish. You got three, two, and one. That's right. So not getting comfortable here at this pace. This is your walk and recovery. You've got just over 20 seconds to breathe. That's right. 
still tall, still confident, every step, every breath of the way. Reminding yourself, every thought that moves itself through your mind will move through your body. So be mindful. Direct the energy of the mind so you can direct that body into action. Starting right here. 30 seconds. Here we go in three. Here we go in two. And here we go in one, team. Come on. Pushing it. Leaning into it. That's right. This is you taking action. Immediate action. You got less than 20 seconds. Take an action on your goals right here, whatever they may be. Come on. 10 seconds of work. Focus is sharp. We got three, two, and one. Once again, you walk, you recover, you breathe. Yes. Less than 30 seconds. Yeah, you're getting a little used to this. I see you working, that's right. Good moving, good breathing, good rhythm. This is your workflow right here. Getting that metabolism online, getting your physiology online, getting those muscles online. So we got our third 30 second effort right here. All right, staying focused all the way through. Let's get him in three. Here we go in two, and here we go in one. Come on. That's it. That's right, right into the effort, right into the challenge. That's how you overcome. That's it, come on, stick with it. You're over halfway through the effort right here. What do you got, come on. Still going, still moving. We got five seconds. We got three, two, and we get another walk in recovery for 30 seconds. Right. Things are moving quickly now. We're turning the page yet again to 20 second efforts. 20 seconds on. 20 seconds of walk and recovery. Now the speeds we're working at here. Right. That fourth gear, that hard run, that's where we want to be reaching. Some of us getting up into that sprint effort, using the top side of that body to really generate speed and intensity from one stride to the next. 20 seconds of work right here. Let's go on three. Here we go in two, and here we go in one. Come on. That's right. We got three of these 20 second efforts lined up for you. You're on the attack mode right here. That's right, come on. Still leaning, still lifting. Less than 10 to go right here, come on. That's right. That's right, less than 15. We got three, two, and one. Bring it down, that's right. A short, intermittent work recovery work recovery cycles right here that's right 10 seconds to breathe all right and shifting right back up all right, this is you doing you that's it come on locking in in three here we go in two and here we go in one 20 seconds come on Woo! that's it keep charging now it's happening fast now you're moving fast you got less than 10 seconds right here the knees lift up, the elbows pump. You got three, you got two, and you got one. Bringing it down again. Yes. That's right. One more 20 second effort. You're still tall, more confident than ever. Just over five seconds. Take a deep breath of a highly potent, highly positive thought right here as you lock in in three. Here we go in two, and here we go in one. Come on. I know you got more speed. I know you got more intensity. I know you want it more than this. Let's go. Come on. You got to dig in. Come on. We got less than 10 seconds. Keep pushing. Five to finish. That's right. We got three, two, and one. And recover in 20 seconds. So I want you to know we're turning that last, that final page right here onto your 10 second effort stay focused stay with me it's going to happen fast all right so commit recommit to whatever got you here today that motivation if it's in your mind let's put it into that body right here lock it in 10 seconds of all you got in three two and one come on you gotta dig you gotta want it you gotta use that body right here come on keep pushing keep digging we got three you got two and let's walk it out short dose of recovery right here 
10 seconds. Still breathing. Direct that focus onto what's next. Come on. 10 seconds of hard work starts in three. Here we go in two. And here we go in one. Come on. Lean into it. Lift into it. Charge into it like it means something to you right here. Come on. That's right. Knees are higher. Elbows pump harder. We got three. Two. Walk it out. One. Last. Recovery. Now, all this is going to take is all you got. I know you got it. Now, let's be willing to give it. It's all about the willingness. Locking in right here in three. Ten seconds in two. And here we go in one. This is your last effort. Come on. Dig in. Charge in. Everything you got. Come on. We got three, two, and one. Walk it out. Breathe it out. That's right. I'm going to give you a whole minute here. That's right. Feel the accomplishment. You deserve it. If you feel a little bit of pride, that's okay. You deserve it. You stay consistent with this habit. You continue to push yourself like this. You continue to challenge yourself and overcome the challenge like this. That's when you start constructing a version of yourself that'll do anything, anything it takes to get more of what you want. Let's shift into a, a light jog pace, maybe a trot. We're gonna take it home here, starting in three. A little one minute recovery trot in two. And here we go in one. So allowing yourself to fill that body again. You've gone through some hard work. You got through the heat, the pressure. You overcame. You adapted. You did what you had to do. So continually remind yourself of what it is you're working for. What is it you want more of? I want to thank you for choosing Suffer City, choosing the Digital Runners, your program to improve the speed, your intensity of running, your endurance, whatever it is you're here to improve upon. We want to thank you for choosing Suffer City, the digital runner, and me personally, Jason, I thank you for doing whatever it takes to be able to lend a better contribution to whatever community you happen to be in. Because I know, you know, that doing this work, doing the hard work, uh, makes you a little bit more competent at whatever it is you happen to do. So we'll see you next time here at Suffer City. I'll look forward to it. Thanks again for running through this 25-minute Encino run. We'll see you next time. This is Jason signing off.